you are listening to the voice of the gospel a proclamation of the holy gospel by wisdom ministries february 21st first sunday of lent let's begin this day with the blessings of god a reading from the holy gospel according to saint mark chapter 1 verses 12 to 15 the spirit immediately drove him out into the wilderness he was in the wilderness 40 days tempted by satan and he was with the wild beasts and the angels waited on him now after john was arrested jesus came to galilee proclaiming the good news of god and saying the time is fulfilled and the kingdom of god has come near repent and believe in the good news the gospel of the lord praise the lord jesus christ dear friends on the first sunday of lent the gospel reading in each uh, uh, reading lectionary is about jesus temptation in the desert this event in the life of jesus is reported in each of the synoptic gospels matthew mark and luke but it is not found in john's gospel this year we read mark's account of this event compared to the gospels of matthew and luke the details throughout mark's narrative are sparse this is evident in mark's account of jesus temptation in the desert mark tells us only that jesus was led into the desert by the spirit that for 40 days he was tempted by satan the gospels of matthew and luke explain that Jesus fasted while the desert that Satan presented him with the three temptations and that Jesus refused to each one quoting scripture only the gospel of uh, gospels of Matthew and Mark report that angels ministered to Jesus at the end of his time in the desert in each of the synoptic gospels the temptation of Jesus follows his baptism by John the Baptist In Mark's gospel we are told that Jesus went into the desert immediately after his baptism led by the spirit Jesus public ministry in Galilee begins after his temptation in the desert Mark's gospel makes a connection between the arrest of John the Baptist and the beginning of Jesus ministry Jesus preaching about the kingdom of God is in continuity with the preaching of John the Baptist but it is also something new as Jesus announces it the kingdom of God is beginning the time of the fulfillment of god's promises is here the fact that jesus spent 40 days in the desert is significant this recalls the 40 years that uh, the israelites wandered in the desert after being led from the slavery in egypt the prophet isaiah was also journeyed in the desert for 40 days and 40 nights making his way to horeb the mountain of god where he was also attended by an angel of the lord remembering the significance of these events we also set aside 40 days for the season of lent in mark's gospel the desert marks beginning of jesus battle with the satan the ultimate test will be in jesus final hours on the cross in a similar way our lenten observances are only a beginning a preparation for and a reinforcement of our ongoing struggle to resist the temptations we face in our lives during lent we are led by the holy spirit to remember the vows of baptism in which we promise to reject sin and to follow jesus just as jesus was ministered by to by the angels god also supports us in the struggle against him and temptation we succeed because jesus conquered sin once and for all in his saving death on the cross amen may god bless us